everybody welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for clicking on our video today we are always happy to have you guys here so if you're watching today's video kindly consider subscribing to the channel do not forget to like and share this video with your friends and family and you can also leave me a comment let me know uh, which outfit for this video is your favorite and why So on today's video we are still on the topic of rehearsal dinner planning and some of the things that you need to know and on our previous video we had talked about uh, deciding who's hosting and we, are, we had also talked about uh, putting together a budget and today we are going to start off with working out the guest list. So the reason you're having a rehearsal dinner is so that you can get quality time with those that are close to you so you need to make sure that they are on the guest list so the must invites are your immediate families your wedding party and their spouses or their significant others the parents of your flower girls or the ring bearers and your officiant and their spouse or significant other So if you have a lot of guests traveling from out of town then it's polite to invite most if not all of them and if that's too many you need to give them a nearby dinner ideas and directions on your wedding website. And I would also like to share with you one bonus tip is that one way to include everyone without, you know, expanding the guest list for the actual dinner is to have welcome drinks or dessert for all of your guests after the rehearsal dinner. So guys, thank you so much for watching our today's video. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe and we'll be able to share more tips on our next video. Thank you so much for watching and see you on the next one.
Don't leave me here 